you know, I, I think one great example is, you know, we, we look at the customers that we convert it, you know, from he metal halide to T8. Mm -hmm. And then we take those same customers that might have went T8 to generation one LED and controls. Uh, those same customers are calling us back today, you know, and the reason why is they, they understood the, that they had savings in every step of the road, mm. uh, but it's time to upgrade again. Mm. It's time to go with a more efficient LED product with the proper optics, and it's time to uh, get smart about their controls. Mm. Um, and, and I think getting smart about controls isn't just using smart controls, but it's having a smart service plan mm. so you know that your system acts today the same way that it's gonna act at the end of your warranty five to 10 years later. So worth it, so worth it. And then to, to take that a step further, you know, not only are we remotely monitoring and making sure it's running right, but we can also be proactive and do energy optimizations. Right. Right, wow. we can look at occupancy sensing. We can, you know, look maybe in your warehouse, you no longer look, use this aisle. Maybe we can turn those lights off at certain times. Sure. We can really analyze that and pull reports. Heat maps. Heat yeah. maps, Heat maps. exactly. So I had a really sad conversation with uh, a customer that I've been working with for years. Um, they aren't my, they weren't, when I left my previous company, um, who if you've gone to LinkedIn and figured out who I am, you probably know who that is. Um, but uh, we, we won't name any names right now. Uh, I worked with this, con this particular end user um, for years and then you know, left that company and, and now um, we're coming back and talking to them about service because that control system doesn't have a, a service program built into it. The, the sad part of the conversation was that uh, the statement was made that, you know, I just want to get the thing running um, so that, I know, uh, that I'm, I'm sure that it's working properly for at least three years because I'm pretty sure we're going to be tearing it out in three years. It broke my heart. This is a system that they're supposed to grow with over 20 years, right? That if the value of that system has been properly uh, built into uh, the actual working system, well, what, what was sold to them actually materializes because it's been properly maintained or properly provisioned in the first place, um, they would never say something like that. But to think that you know a, a few years into using this control system that they've invested so much money, they're already thinking about getting rid of it. It it, it just um, is unfortunate, and it's something that having a a company that cares about the long term effects and the long term life of a control system involved with your projects as opposed to somebody who just wants to install it and get off the project or somebody that just wants to sell you the product and get out of there. Different motivations yield different end products. But with a company whose motivation is the long-term success, success of, of that system, you, you have the best shot of, of having the best experience with these systems.